My name is Simon Waddington and I lead the Gene Transfer Technology Group in the Institute for Women's Health. Um, and one of the main goals of our team is to develop genetic medicine, gene therapy or gene stem cell therapy for very early onset uh, genetic diseases. In other words, genetic diseases such as um, uh, neurological disease, uh, such as some diseases affecting the liver that are inherited from the parents um, and these diseases uh, uh, are fatal or severely injuring uh, to the uh, newborn baby or to the young child. And so what we're looking at doing is, is trying to work up um, a range of different genetic medicines for the treatment of these diseases, um, hopefully so that with a single injection is that we can provide a treatment that will last for um, uh, weeks, months, uh, or even years uh, of that life and allow the child to, to grow up um, normally and, and unaffected by the disease. One of our recent um, interesting successes, I think, has been in looking at um, a preclinical model of uh, what is called neuronopathic Gaucher disease, which is a degenerative disease of the brain. Uh, and so here what we've been able to do is by using a, a gene therapy um, injected into, into newborn mice that have this disease is that we've been able to um, uh, extend their lifespan from what is only 14 days in their case uh, up to more than 140 days. Uh, and, and the entire idea is then actually is to then explore the, the, the concept of whether um, uh, gene therapy could be used in newborn babies after appropriate uh, diagnosis or maybe actually if the disease um, uh, was so severe whether there was even a possibility of treating the infant before they were born.